after long exhausting journeys via Qatar and US military bases, Afghan refugees settle in the city of Bowling Green, Kentucky, where they start a new American way of life. Have a look. After exhausting journeys that took them from Kabul to Qatar to European cities to US military bases, Afghan families fleeing the Taliban alighted in Kentucky, in a small city well versed in receiving refugees. Bowling Green has welcomed waves of refugees over four decades, beginning with the Cambodians in the 1980s, then Bosnians in the 90s plus Iraqis, Burmese and Congolese and others which have helped make the city a cultural melting pot. Wazir Khan Zadran was a tribal leader who fought 20 years ago against the Haqqani network, a powerful faction within the Taliban. Although he more recently worked with a non-governmental organization, he knew the Taliban would come for him. Zadran said the Americans saved him and his family by picking them in the Chinook helicopter in August and taking them to the Kabul airport. After expelling a New Mexico military base, they were sent to Bowling Green and quickly realized they had lucked out in their new American lives. And we are so happy uh, in Bowling Green and everything is good. My children is going uh, nowadays to school uh, and uh, and the government uh, here, NGO center and all, they are doing very well with us. Also the local community is helping us and they are coming and they are introducing the culture to us. In the aftermath of rising anti-immigrant and refugee sentiment during the Trump administration, the US government is now handling its biggest refugee evacuation since Vietnam. Mike Givens, leader of Bowling Green's Forest Park Baptist Church says, Congolese refugees have breathed new life in the community. Our community has changed so that if we do not uh, seek or, or, or go after the immigrant population, our church will not survive because the population has changed so dramatically and the older church is dying out and we're trying to get uh, new members into our church that live in the community that will extend the life of the church. And that's our goal. Bowling Green offers agricultural and manufacturing jobs boasting an assembly plant that makes Chevrolet Corvette. Zadran, whose six children are learning songs in English and even sent off Dear Santa letters, will likely see an estimated 350 more Afghans resettle in Bowling Green in 2022.